pretty wild. Take a look. Can you think about a, an area or a world where all you would need to pay for your groceries is your hand? Yes, Amazon now bringing its pay by palm technology to Whole Foods. It will soon be in more than 500 Whole Foods stores by the end of the year. Consumers who choose to use the program called Amazon One won't need their wallet or a cell phone to pay. They can simply hover their palm over the Amazon device. However, of course, not everybody's on board with paying by palm. Some privacy experts have raised some concerns about sharing biometric data with Amazon. Explain this right here. Now, let me help you out real quick. Explain this right here. Now, this is a book a lot of y'all grew up on and that you say, you know what? Now that I've gotten older, I've seen preachers come in for cases. I've seen preachers stealing money. I've seen people in the church hurt my feelings. I mean, I experienced people in the church hurting my feelings. I've seen so much wrong. I've seen the internet era come and present so many different the theologies that you know what? I don't believe in the Bible no more. I don't go to church no more. All of the above. Now, this is my question. Now, all that might be true. I'm not going to argue with that. <laughs> I'm not going to argue with that. I don't want to argue with nobody about religion, the concepts of Christ, none of that. But this is what I want you to do. This book was established before the person that you studied, 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 studied. What am I saying? You read a book. That was basically somebody else's theology, somebody else's theory. This book was created before that person was even in existence, right? So let's, let's think about this. Now, this book talks about you will not be able to buy, sell, or trade unless you have this mark. This right here is saying that, hey, you won't be able to buy from Whole Foods unless you have this. Now, this is called prophecy. Now, explain to me how this book, explain to me how that this book, explain to me how Bible prophecy was foretold way beforehand, years and years and years and years ago. And now in 2023, we're starting to see the manifestation of what the Bible said. This book right here said what's going to happen. Tell me why it's happening right now. Explain to me how this book was written a long time ago. Let's not talk about Jesus. Let's not talk about nobody walking on water. Let's not talk about somebody going down in the belly of the well. Let's stick with one subject, Bible prophecy. How this book was written so long ago, and now in 2023, you're starting to see the, the groundwork established and done and the prophecy is manifesting and coming true today. Somebody help me out. Explain that. Don't talk about nothing else. Don't get in my comments with nothing. Answer my freaking question. And I'm out.